let's get to the business. Scott 2020, and I'm starting with the new, all new Addict RC. Uh, what the Addict RC is, uh, you know, uh, I'm having more and more problems uh, explaining to you different types of bikes each year because uh, there are more types of bike coming and also some bikes are becoming like in between different worlds and that's exactly what Scott RC, Addict RC is. I think that um, the, the most simple way to explain what Addict RC is is uh, the best of two worlds aero racing bikes and climbing bikes. Scott Addict was a climbing super lightweight bike. Scott Foil, which I'm gonna show you in a second, is the aero racing bike. And Addict RC got features from both worlds. So what it got? As you can see, there is no cables outside. Even the foil so far still has the outer cables. This one has the cables routed in the handlebars, in the stem. It even goes through the upper uh, bearing here on your headset, through the head tube and then down to the frame, to your front and rear derailleur and of course the housing for the rear uh, caliper brake. The front one is also hidden inside the fork, through axles both front and rear. Uh, more racy, more aero geometry and all the shaping is now even more aero optimized. The seat post is aero optimized. It's not a huge aerodynamic seat post, but it is aero optimized. It is like D shaped. I think Giant call uh, their seat post D shaped, but this is this this has the shape of a D. Uh, so once uh, on one hand it will uh, flex a little bit. On the other hand, it should be more aerodynamic. But the frame really looks uh, much more aerodynamic and it has two areas. Uh, the engineers were focusing on the fork, head tube, down tube and chain stays for stiffness and handling. So the, the, this tube is massive. You can see how massive it is with a massive BB, which means that uh, when you push your bike, you, you lean the bike on the corner it will go exactly where you want to. And also when you push the pedals, your power is transferred to the rear wheel through the drivetrain, that's one area. And then the second area is the top tube, the seat stays, the seat tube, and the, the seat post, which is going to give you a little bit of compliance on the bike. Those who were testing the bike say that it does work, it feels great, it feels stiff, it feels kinda compliant. I haven't been riding this bike uh, yet. And the geometry is more racy than on the non-RC Addict. So let me just uh, do a walk around of this Addict and then we'll go and see the whole range of the Addict bikes. And question to you guys, what's the width of this tire? It's not 25C, which uh, became very popular uh, with the road bikes. 23C is old school already, but this is, 28C my friend so with the disc brakes 28 standard with uh, clear clearance for the 30C so this is how it looks like this is massive 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 and the uh, chain stays are massive as well of course the through axles looking good looking really good of course uh, replacing the cables will be more complicated with with this system you know me you know my my approach to this so this was the addict rc this is the addict non-rc this is the frame set that uh, still continues from 2019 to 2020 this is the endurance bike a more upright position but this is a racing bike so you can race on it it's not a recreational uh, geometry at all um, but this bike in the disc brake version has also lots of clearance, 28C tires, great endurance bike. Um, and then we've got the foil, we're going to compare the foil in a second. And then the gravel. This is the Scott Addict Gravel. Um, and uh, this is not the same frame set as on the Addict, just called gravel and 
with the different components and the tires. This is different frame. When you look at the Addict, this is the, let's say, Addict 30. You can see how the front end of the bike looks like. This is the Scott Addict Gravel. Different head tube, more massive, massive uh, fork. I'm not sure about the clearance, whether it will have more clearance uh, than the Addict on the disc brakes. This is non-disc brakes, uh, so not that much clearance. Oh, this is the disc brakes version. I think, yes, it has more clearance right here. Uh, of course, uh, now the new uh, Shimano GRX gravel uh, group set. Uh, and so I don't know why is it called Addict, because some might feel that this is same frame set with uh, gravel specs, but this is actually different bike. So it could be called like Scott gravel bike. So we've got Scott Addict RC, the aero climbing bike. <laughs> <laughs> I can say so, I think. The Endurance Addict and the Addict Gravel. Now the foil. The foil is the aerodynamic uh, bike. It continues from 2019 to 2020. And what are the differences? Let's try to compare it in the next episode.